If you want to have a play around with Drupal CMS, just click into the 2.0 alpha and to run it, to install it, all you need to do is create a folder and then just run these commands. So you just jump in. Of course, you want to use ddev for your environment. And then you just run a few of these commands. And if I jump over then to here and the readme, you then want to unpack it and then launch it. And that will pretty much give you uh, the installation page. Now, I was going to do it live, but in the past I've been bitten before by Composer, all of a sudden pulling in a brand new module update, which then happens to break something. So I don't want to do all of that now, but what I will do is show you what the installation looks like because things are different for version two of Drupal CMS. So if we jump over here, okay, we have the standard installation. Now let's just enter in the names. I'll, I'll enter in Drupal Canvas and then, then you click on next. And now you get to choose between two site templates. You have Starter and you also have Byte. Now, one thing to be aware of, the, the term site template, it's not a theme, okay? This is the thing that confused me. When I was playing around with this for the first time, I was like, okay, so what, is there a new theme? I do know that, that there is a new Mercury theme. So is there a Byte theme and a Starter theme? And it's like, no, 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 it's not. Essentially what it is, if you come into recipes, you see this byte. It is the, where is it? Type, here we go, up the top here. So site templates are a form of a recipe. And think of it as, the best way to kind of think of it is like another type of installation profile. And I do believe that Drupal CMS starter is the starter. Yes, okay, yeah, see, that one is the starter. And then all of these other recipes, what do they have as type? Okay, type Drupal CMS. Okay, so these are kind of the general recipes that just configure things, but then a site template is really just a template of a website. It's functionality, not its look and feel, but it also can be its look and feel, but that's the thing that, the terms might be a little confusing if you're a old Drupal developer like myself, because that's the first thing I looked for. So just be aware of that. So what we're going to do 